Hey guys, welcome back. <coughs> I believe we're at lesson three. Um, so I set up my project file, my uh, project window and project, and I'm just going to do the initial setup. So I'm going to go to to view, image plane, and import image, and we're going to go to front hit apply okay and we'll select the image here and we'll go down to image center Z and then we'll just highlight the image center Z middle mouse click and we'll just drag out let's make this 50. and then image center X what we're trying to do is I'm trying to line up with the belly button here so I'm going to, going to bring this across uh, let's make this three Try 2.9. Okay, perfect. Oh. Okay. And I'm just going to click here and bring this slider down just a bit. And holding down Alt, we're just going. Make sure you have it middle mouse click down first, and you have press Alt, and then we can just slowly bring this down. Middle mouse, hold down Alt, and roughly there. I think that's the best we're going to get. Okay. Like I said, the human body is not designed for uh, perfect symmetry. But I think if we take an average, I think that would be better. I mean, just as long as you've got equal distance between the breast area um, we'll worry about the belly button I mean looking at this is actually more to the side over there but um, that's the best we can do and as you can see uh, it's off so we'll just model t to the neck area and so, our front image is done. And what we can do, we can go to the attribute editor and we'll just let look through camera. So it's not displayed in our perspective view, but it's still displayed in the front view. And we'll put the side and open. Now we really don't need to line this up with anything really. Now we can just drag this across. So in the X, image center X, we'll just drag this back. Oh, okay. We'll turn this back on. there bear with me and so I'm going to 
to 50. Okay, just so we can see our grid. And uh, we'll just do the same. Here, attribute editor, look through camera. Okay, and frame and all. Now we just want to make sure that our image planes are lining up. So what we can do is uh, take a plane. Uh, if we go through perspective view, I'm holding down shift, right click, and create a plane. And what we'll do is oh, select the plane, and we'll just increase the size. Sign up with the top of the ankles and double check and top of the ankles. Oh, I apologize for the stuttering. Um, I have an ATI card and he really doesn't want Maya. And I'm just going to duplicate and we'll bring this up to there. And we'll just uh, and duplicate again just under the armpits and duplicate and just above the shoulders okay and duplicate again and just below there and we're really doing this just to see um, just to get them lined up correctly duplicate again and we'll bring down go back to our front view and okay shoulders okay get rid of these our scene is um, complete I'll save this and uh, I'll upload it to a uh, file hosting so if you want to follow along uh, you can uh, in the next lesson we'll start by blocking out our initial uh, torso and then uh, we'll take it from there so I'll see you guys in the next lesson